Next, NASA says its Voyager 1 probe, the most distant human-made object in the universe, is sending usable information to Earth again after months of spouting gibberish. Launched by NASA 45 years ago, Voyager 1 was originally designed for a mission lasting just five years, yet it continues to explore the far reaches of the universe. Today, this legendary spacecraft is transmitting data that has left many of NASA's top scientists puzzled. In fact, some believe they may have uncovered evidence suggesting the spacecraft could be under alien control. What's their take on this? Stick around as we dive into the strange data Voyager 1 has been sending back in today's video. Let's dive in. NASA's Voyager 2 spacecraft, launched in August 1977, embarked on its mission to explore Jupiter and Saturn before continuing on to Uranus and Neptune, marking the start of the Voyager program. Voyager 1, its sister spacecraft, was launched just days after Voyager 2. The timing of both launches was critical for the mission's success. Each spacecraft had the mass of a compact car. In 1977, NASA identified a rare opportunity when all the key planets aligned for efficient exploration, allowing spacecraft to travel with minimal course adjustments. However, NASA decided on a 16-day delay, ensuring their trajectories diverged slightly. As a result, Voyager 1, though launched later, overtook its twin in December 1977. Since its launch, Voyager 1 has become one of NASA's most vital instruments for exploring the universe and uncovering its captivating secrets. In 1978, when the spacecraft was approximately 265 million kilometers from Earth, it began transmitting images of Jupiter. A year later, Voyager 1 spent nearly 100 hours capturing over 4,000 photos of Jupiter, allowing scientists to create the first time-lapse of the gas giant's rotation. Just a month afterward, it became the first spacecraft to detect Jupiter's rings and discover two new moons. Its next mission took it to Saturn, where a slight course adjustment was needed to avoid a collision with Titan, Saturn's largest moon. As Voyager 1 orbited Saturn, it sent back numerous images of the ringed planet and uncovered four of its moons. Following this, NASA decided to end Voyager 1's mission, directing the spacecraft toward the outer limits of the solar system. Meanwhile, Voyager 2 continued its journey toward the ice giants, Uranus and Neptune, nearly 6 billion kilometers from the Sun. The Voyager interstellar mission commenced in 1990 with the historic first-ever portrait of our solar system. Voyager 1 captured stunning images of several distinct planets. After the spacecraft had taken over 67,000 photos, NASA no longer found the images useful. To conserve power, NASA switched off the cameras on Voyager 1 in 1998 when it was 10.3 billion kilometers away from the Sun. At that point, the spacecraft passed the Pioneer 10, which had been launched by NASA in 1972. Voyager 1 eventually surpassed Pioneer 10, becoming the farthest human-made object from Earth, continuing to widen its distance as it ventures further into interstellar space. Despite the camera shutdown, NASA still maintained communication with the spacecraft through its remaining instruments. In 2012, Voyager 1 successfully left our solar system and entered interstellar space, but NASA kept this achievement under wraps until 2013. Currently moving away from the sun at a speed of 61.1 kilometers per hour, Voyager 1, alongside its twin Voyager 2, won't fully exit the solar system until 2018. By that time, it will have traveled nearly 14.5 billion kilometers from the Sun. Throughout its journey, Voyager 1 has transmitted invaluable data about the solar system and beyond to NASA. However, recently, the spacecraft has shown signs of losing some of its coordination, sending back strange signals that even some of the world's top scientists are unable to decipher. The spacecraft seems to have lost track of its position. Although it is still capable of sending an alert to NASA if it becomes lost in space, that alarm hasn't been triggered yet, even though the situation remains uncertain. Additionally, Voyager 1's antenna appears to be functioning properly, and the spacecraft continues to maintain regular communication with NASA. However, NASA is growing more doubtful about the accuracy of the antenna's reports. For now, Voyager 1 can still receive commands from Earth and execute them while in deep space. The spacecraft, which was designed in the 1970s, 
highlights the far-reaching nature of NASA's technology. However, NASA insists that the signals from Voyager 1 don't provide insight into the spacecraft's current status. So, you might be wondering, what's actually happening on board? Every NASA spacecraft is equipped with a gold-plated disc featuring a unique design, in case it ever comes into contact with extraterrestrial life. This disc holds important audio and visual messages, including over 35 Earth-specific sounds, images of daily life on Earth, more than an hour of Western pop music, and greetings from several former U.S. presidents, all translated into 55 languages, just in case the aliens can comprehend any of them. As of 2022, NASA scientists have dismissed the idea that aliens might be controlling the spacecraft. If Voyager 1 were ever at risk, its numerous safety protocols would activate, though none have been needed so far. The fact that Voyager 1's antenna remains pointed at Earth, even though the spacecraft systems seem to be operating normally, only adds to the mystery of the strange signals it's sending. In similar circumstances in the past, the spacecraft has never transmitted such enigmatic messages. So why, with Voyager 1 so far from Earth, is it suddenly emitting these signals? Something is clearly happening. But according to NASA's Voyager mission manager, it's typical for a spacecraft as old as Voyager 1. Launched 45 years ago, it has traveled 23.6 billion kilometers, or about 157.5 astronomical units from the Sun. As the spacecraft moves farther away, maintaining continuous communication becomes more challenging. Not only is this a concern, but Voyager 1 cannot be reliably repaired. NASA currently doesn't have the capability to build a spacecraft for interstellar travel that could reach Voyager 1 for a rescue mission if something were to go wrong. Practically and physically, it's just not possible. Moreover, the communication speed has slowed significantly. It now takes, on average, two days for a message from NASA's ground station to reach the spacecraft. NASA's team is facing significant challenges in maintaining effective communication, particularly in the event of an emergency. The vast distance between Earth and Voyager 1 has led to an increased risk of potential collisions and operational mishaps. Despite these concerns, NASA remains optimistic that the current technical issues affecting the spacecraft can be resolved. Voyager 1 continues to be a crucial asset for NASA, as it is responsible for transmitting a growing stream of data about space back to Earth. However, the immense distance between the spacecraft and our planet results in slow and unreliable communication, which poses difficulties for mission control. Nevertheless, this data remains invaluable to NASA, offering unique insights into the farthest reaches of space. NASA is rigorously testing this spacecraft to determine how it compares to other spacecraft in its fleet. This vital data is crucial for future space missions, which won't be able to proceed without it. However, there will come a time when Voyager 1 can no longer communicate with Earth. As each day passes, the likelihood of an unexpected mission-ending event increases. That Voyager 1 has withstood such a harsh environment for so long speaks volumes about its incredible resilience. And with that, this video concludes. How much longer do you think Voyager 1's data transmissions will last? What are your thoughts on the mysterious signals Voyager 1 is sending? Where do you think they're coming from? Let us know in the comments below. If you enjoyed this video, give it a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel for all the latest space news. We have another exciting video lined up for you. Just click on the video on your screen and join us for another thrilling space journey. See you there.